hi friends how are you all doing i hope you're all fine welcome back to my channel thank you so much for returning back here if you are a returning subscriber i really appreciate much but if it's your first time here on my channel hello welcome to my channel please before you leave remember to subscribe and when you subscribe click on that notification bell you will find it down there so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video i promise you you will always enjoy every content that i upload in this channel so my dear friends in our today's video as you already know we are going to be having a matchmaking show and our single lady of today who is searching for her perfect match is from Kenya goes by the name of Nancy a single mother of two beautiful kids in her middle 30s and guys before I go further to tell you more about Nancy it is good for you to see Nancy's photos so that you know whom we are talking about how she looks like so welcome and enjoy friends a bit of Nancy's life background but after me sharing this if you'd like to know more about Nancy do not hesitate to check me out on Instagram at African Bella and on my Facebook page at African Bella the real talk come let's talk if you guys are a perfect match I'm going to match you with Nancy so nancy tells us was born and raised in kenya like i told you is kenyan and currently works in kisumu so, so to her past love relationship experience we already know that nancy is a single mother of two beautiful kids but what happened in her relationship with the father of her two kids so guys nancy tells us fell in love with a kenyan guy everything was good they were crazily in love with each other and because everything was going good they decided to start living together never married legally so as they were keeping on living together you know they are not brother and a sister <laughs> nancy got pregnant with her first child then the second child came life kept on going but the father to her kids started changing character development and it really changed badly because the guy started being very abusive emotionally and physically so when it became too much for nancy to handle decided to walk away and remained as a single mother of two kids so yes guys nancy started her new life as a single mother but again you know loneliness you need someone by your side so decided to put herself out there to look for love again but it became a very big challenge for her to find someone serious in real life that is when nancy came to know about online dating apps and decided to join but tells us her online dating experience has not been a good one it has been very very challenging and as a single mother when she talks to guys they come to know that she is a single mother of two they shy away and eventually run or disappear but recently i talked about this and i told you guys if you are a single mother do not get discouraged just because you're talking to guys on online dating apps and when they hear you are a single mother they lose interest or they just ghost you it shouldn't discourage you at all it shouldn't put your self-esteem down as a single mother you can find love exist that man on online dating apps who will accept you with your kids even not on online dating apps even in real life even on social media platforms you can meet a guy 
who will accept to you so being a single mother you shouldn't take it as a challenge or you shouldn't be like i wish i didn't have kids maybe i could have found love online easily i've seen ladies who are single never married very very young beautiful suffering to find love on online dating apps i'm telling you all this to tell you as a single mother it's not that the challenges you're facing on online dating apps is because of you being a single mother. Not at all. You're just meeting losers. You haven't come across a right guy. So keep on searching. Be happy. Keep being a good mother to your kids. And I have so much respect for you guys, you single mothers out there, because I know it's not easy. May God bless you. So let's keep on with Nancy's profile. So I asked Nancy if she is interested in an interracial relationship or any man of any color. Nancy tells us due to her bad past love relationship experience is interested in trying out something new, which is being in a relationship with a white guy or being in an interracial relationship. So the second question that I asked Nancy is what is love? Nancy tells us she believes that True love is mutual respect, friendship in a relationship, and looking out to one another. Question number three that I asked Nancy, is she willing to relocate? Because if you are interested in an interracial relationship, <laughs> most of the times it's the lady that leaves the country and joins the guy. And most guys that are interested in dating black women, let's take an example, she is in Africa, they want a lady to be able to relocate to his country. So Nancy answers by saying, yes, if I find a right guy, I am willing to relocate to another country. So here comes the question of religion. Nancy tells us she is a Christian and would love her much to be a Christian too. So to the things that Nancy cannot tolerate in a relationship or in a man, Nancy tells us cannot tolerate a man who cheats, a man who disrespects women, a man who doesn't care about family values, and most importantly, a man who will mistreat her kids. Cannot tolerate such kind of a man, and that explains why Nancy has been single for so many years. And with this, guys, I totally agree with Nancy. As a single mother, when you decide to put yourself out there to look for love, you need to be very, very careful. You need to find a guy who will treat your kids as if they were his own. Treat them good, treat them right. Don't just date a guy and then you don't look at how the guy can be a good father to your kids. That would be a very big, big mistake as a single mother. Please, dear sisters, be very, very careful. If you remember a story that I told you of a lady who found a guy and then that guy did not want anything to do with her daughter, brought the lady in Europe and after a lady being in Europe, she also wanted to support the baby back home because she left her daughter there. But because the guy from the beginning never cared about the daughter, did not want to send anything to the daughter, never allowed the lady to work so that she can support her daughter. And guys, when you get married, especially if it is an interracial relationship, you relocate to a guy's country, <laughs> it's not all that easy to walk away ask ladies that have gone through this they are going to tell you because you know when you're just there thinking you haven't found anyone <laughs> you'll be like i can take anyone even if he doesn't want my kids it's okay <laughs> i will figure it out or i'll get married to him and then leave him get married out of desperacy my dear you reach here you marry a guy and when you want to walk away, it's not possible. 
you are going to live a miserable life. Not only you, your kids too, because they need a mother to support them. They need the mother to be there for them. So dear sisters, I'm telling you all this because I really, really love you so much and I don't want you to suffer with your kids. Please, please. So big up to our sister Nancy. And if you are a single guy out there, you have seen Nancy's photos. And now you hear her story, the things that she is looking for in a man. You feel you are a perfect match for Nancy. Please check me out on Instagram at African Bella and on Facebook at African Bella The Real Talk. Nothing is impossible <laughs> when there is love. So to Nancy's character, you as a single guy watching this, you would like to know how is Nancy? So Nancy tells us is a very straightforward girl, faithful and committed. Once she is in love, she is in love. We love you deeply. No one else will exist. I mean other guys. <laughs> yeah. Another thing about Nancy is soft spoken, but has temper when someone offends her. <laughs> And this is totally normal for someone to know how to stand on her grounds. <laughs> when things turn out differently, when you offend her or when you try to play games on her. <laughs> so it's not a bad thing actually, it is a good thing. So to Nancy's ideal man, Nancy tells us her ideal man should be faithful, someone with family values, a guy who will accept her with her two beautiful kids and treat them as if they were his own without discriminating them. Some of her best qualities tells us is a very hardworking woman and dedicated. Also tells us she believes when you marry your best friend, friend it becomes easy since you are able to relate well some of her other qualities tells us she is a very good cook a family person and beautiful now to the countries of her preference <laughs> where she wants her match to come from so country number one is usa germany canada Switzerland and any other country apart from UAE and India. So if you are in the mentioned countries, please check me out on Instagram at African Bella and on my Facebook page at African Bella The Real Talk. Let us talk and if you guys are a perfect match, I'm going to match you with Nancy and you begin your love journey. So dear friends, to the age range that Nancy is looking at, Nancy tells us would want her match to be 35 years old to 43. So if you are in that age range and everything that I said about Nancy, you feel like you match or they match what you're looking for in a woman, please do not worry, just check me out on those social media handles that I have mentioned before. So dear friends, before I end this video, I want to wish my beautiful sister Nancy all the best in her search for her perfect match. Let us wish her all the best guys, pray for her so that she can find that right man that she is searching for. Guys, if you have watched this video till now, thank you so much. May God bless you. Please give this video a thumbs up. Share it with your friends, family, everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something. Watch my other videos too. They are super, super good. Comment below what you think about this video. I would like to know. Until next time, guys, I love you so much. You're always here in my heart. Ciao, ciao.